Hey guys, it's Rachel. Welcome back to my channel. So today is VMA day. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and vlog because, you know, I don't know if we're going to see Taylor, but I'm really, really hoping so. She was spotted a couple days ago in New York City, so I'm really hoping that she's going to go. <sighs> she's nominated for so much at the VMAs, and um, I'm just really, really manifesting that we see her beautiful face tonight, but I thought it would be fun to vlog regardless, and I'm going to hang out with Bobby a little bit today, and we're going to go to Plato's Closet, see if we can get some coins for Harry, because it's in two weeks, <laughs> and um, yeah, we're really excited, and I'm just going to take you guys along this, this pajama set isn't gonna do though we need to get in Taylor Swift merch and now I am more VMA ready I have on my little Taylor Swift red sunglass I really think that I got this one at Cracker Barrel remember when Cracker Barrel randomly had like Taylor merch yeah <laughs> I think that's where I got this no no I got this on her site when they had like a massive sale but um no it's my gray one that's from Cracker Barrel it's like a little silhouette tee um, but that was so random, like, Taylor Merch at Cracker Barrel. Anyways, um, that's the shirt I'm wearing today. Bright red lipstick on, we're just, oh, I need my red ring. I decided to wear my red Keds today, and I have not worn my red Keds in maybe, um, years and years. Um, Keds were very popular, like, in 2012, 2013, even, like, into the 1989 era when Taylor, um, had the collab with them, and I have my collection of them. And I hardly ever wear them anymore, and today it just sparked me. And I was talking to Alexa, she's like, whip out the red Keds. They are so flat. Like, I feel like they look like bowling shoes. <laughs> I used to wear Keds every day, like, oh my gosh. But they still fit. <laughs> he, he literally, like, flew after me. He just said, I would like some attention. And I said, okay, okay, sir. <laughs> you see yourself? Yes. See yourself. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> Bobby found her love onto her outfit. <laughs> we got a make chicken. Uh, and then we got two double cheeseburgers. He spit. One for you, one for me. <laughs> and then we have my small fry. Oh. And that's what that's for. And then um, a couple of little ketchups. It's for you. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. And I'm gonna get the fries at the bottom of the bag because I did the haul. Fair. Since when does H&M have Ed Sheeran merch? And the 2016 Taylor fans, if you know, you know. So Bobby and I went to the mall and we also, oh God, that's driving me nuts. Um, okay. So Bobby and I went to the mall. We didn't find anything. Um, we're both kind of just like tired of the mall and we've decided definitely once we get back from Harry that we're gonna go thrifting um, just because we feel like we can find what we need thrifting and I don't know all the stores are getting so expensive like even Forever 21 it's just gotten so expensive over the years um, and we just feel like the quality is just not great um, so we definitely want to go thrifting and find some like unique pieces and stuff instead of going to the mall also, I dropped my stuff off at Plato's, um, and I, I was kind of shocked because I went back in, Bobby stayed in my car, um, because it was so hot. Bobby's like, do you care if I just stay in the car with the, the air on? I'm like, go for it, girl. So I let her stay in my car. I went in, and, um, they were like, um, so we can offer you seven dollars. And I was like, okay, like, can I see, like, what you guys took? Um, because I had, like, a lot in there. Um, and so they were trying to give me $7 for a crew neck, like a backpack, um, like this. 
and you cannot even see that it's like a little like target backpack um what else like jewelry and all that and i was like um i was like no i declined their offer um of seven dollars because it was like a lot of good stuff that they were trying to sell me or get for seven dollars and i was like no like i'm good um so didn't do anything good at plato's closet today and bobby also was like it's so crazy to me because like we walked around um plato's before we went and got lunch she's like it's so crazy to me because they are taking mainly Shein stuff, like Shein, however you want to say it. And Bobby and I both don't support Shein, number one, because um, we've heard way too many bad things about Shein. And number two, the quality is just not good. And Bobby's like, I'm not going to buy stuff from Play-Doh's Closet that is, you know, is Shein. Like, so much of the stuff is Shein, like, that we're shocked. Um... So anyways, Plays Closet was a fail, but it's okay. We had a good time like walking around the mall. We're really trying to save our money before Harry. Um, so really we were just kind of like window shopping anyways. So um, I really want to go ahead and like shower before the VMAs and like get comfortable. The red carpet's about to start. Um, I don't know if Taylor's going to go or not. I really hope that she does. Like... Uh, I really really miss her sweet face like everybody's like oh like I want her to like announce something or whatever and I'm just like I just want to see her face like I just want to see her you know anyways so I hope that she goes um not sure that she will but we're gonna we're gonna see together <laughs> okay so um I'm in shambles right now because Oscar De La Renta posted shining just for you tonight and it's a picture of the back of a dress and everybody's like oh my god um I'm really hoping it's <laughs> Alexis guys that was a little sus Oscar De La Renta literally said shining just for you don't play with me like that first of all um if that if that turns out to be like just a cute little caption and it's somebody else's outfit i'm gonna be in shambles anyways um what the heck was i gonna say oh you know what i was gonna say so today i did like eyeliner and i used to be an eyeliner everyday girly now i am an eyeliner everyday girly to some extent now meaning like I like putting it on like my bottom waterline because I think it makes my eyes pop a little bit and makes me look less tired. But I used to do like winged eyeliner every day and I just, I don't know, something about it just isn't my thing on myself anymore. Like I like the more natural look on myself now, but um, I felt like going all out today, but I don't know. I just wanted to say that. Like it's just so crazy how... I've got the hiccups. Um, it's just so crazy how your your makeup can just change so fast, like your your likes and everything. So I don't know. I've just been doing like very um, light natural makeup lately, and like I've loved it. So maybe it's just because I've like not gone this heavy on makeup in a while. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying right now. <sighs> Taylor Swift, please go. <laughs> Guys, like like. My friend Erin is there. She's on the red carpet and she saw a tree and she actually took a picture and then page six is reporting that Taylor's um, gonna do like a surprise appearance and I literally, oh my God. Why am I about to cry? She's literally there. I'm gonna throw up. She posted a TikTok. She posted a TikTok. Apparently, she posted a TikTok. Help, 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 help. She did. Okay, Taylor's first award. Taylor's first award. All right, I'm gonna set. I'm gonna set you down on my big foot. Let's just hope it stays. You guys like my... Please. 
please. I'm ready to hear Taylor talk. Where's Wonder Woman? There's so many nominees. Oh my gosh. Like, look. Okay, long form video. The VMA goes to Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. <laughs> Video. Uh, I'm nervous. Hey, girls, too. I'm so honored to have been recognized alongside such amazing artists and directors in this category, and I just want to say I'm so heartened by the fact that for the first time in VMA history, four of the directors nominated in the Video of the Year category are women. And you guys, I'm just so proud of what we made and I, I know with ever, every second of this moment that we wouldn't have been able to make this short film if it weren't for you, the fans. I love her so much. Because I wouldn't be able to re-record my albums if it weren't for you. I love you so much. You emboldened me to do that, and I had, I had sort of made up my mind that if you we're gonna be this generous oh. and give us this. I, I thought it might be a fun moment to tell you. Oh, uh, huh? What? 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 That my brand new album comes out October the 21st. What? Honored 
who have been recognized alongside such amazing artists and directors in this category and I just want to say I'm so heartened by the fact that for the first time in VMA history four of the directors nominated in the video of the year category are women. of what we made and I, I know with ever, every second of this moment that we wouldn't have been able to make this short film if it weren't for you, the fans. I love her so much. Because I wouldn't be able to re-record my albums if it weren't for you. You emboldened me to do that, and I had I had sort of made up my mind that if you were going to be this generous oh. and give us this, I, I thought it might be a fun moment to tell you. Oh, that huh? what? 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 That my brand new album comes out October the twenty first. I'm literally not going to sleep, you guys. I've been on the phone with Natalie, Emma. I've tried to call Alexa. She's not answering. Um, we're all kind of just panicking. Um, more is happening at midnight. I, I... <sighs> Emma, how you feeling? I just like took a. <sighs> oh my god. Hi YouTube. How are you feeling, Natalie? Shaking, crying. Her sight's frozen. I know this. What the hell? Her sight is frozen. Taylor Swift. Oh my god. She didn't even tell us where to meet her. Like your website, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Tumblr. Oh my god. It's literally frozen, Emma. Is it frozen for you? It's, I have, it's loading. Like, I mean, I, I didn't have it up because I'm a, I'm, just, I'm not smart. So now it's, I'm like. It's like. <sighs> She isn't funny. Should I go on Twitter? I don't know what to do with myself. Like, I'm just trying to, like... Mine ain't loading. What is that? I, it's on Twitter. 13 tracks. Oh, no. Her, al her website crashed. I mean, I am not surprised. Is that her album cover? Oh, my God! She tweeted! My, uh, can I read this? <laughs> we lie and wake in love and fear and turmoils and tears. We stare at walls and dr drink until they... <laughs> this is a collection of music written in the middle of the night. A journey of terrors and sweet dreams. The floors we face, <laughs> we face all of us who have tossed and turned. Decided to keep lanterns and keep searching. Hoping that just maybe when the clock strikes 12 we'll meet ourselves. What? Oh my god. She ain't funny. <laughs> so is, is there no sequel? I don't know. It's literally called Midnights. Oh, I am throughout my life. Throughout her life. Like Oh no. Oh my god. That's so clever. Oh my god. Is she... We lie awake in love. I want your midnights. Anyways, um... The site's not working. Thank you. Thank you. And now my computer's being slow. This is unreal. And I love the album cover. I do too. Is that a lighter? Or I thought it was an AirPod. <laughs> a booger just fell into my mouth. <laughs> I 
I hope you know I'm recording all of this. putting that in the vlog I'm sorry <sighs> all right it's a couple days later I still haven't processed it I'm pretty sure the last thing I filmed for this video was like after midnight when we found out it was called midnights honestly honestly it was all kind of a blur um, so much had happened, but anyways, I needed to wrap up this vlog. Um, I've literally filmed two videos about midnights for you guys, and then I was like, oh, I need to finish my VMAs vlog, because now you guys are really excited about it, which I'm, I love you guys. Um, so, I told you guys in my video, welcome to the Midnight's Era, I'll link it down below. I told you guys I vlogged, and you guys were like, oh my gosh, we can't wait to see it. So now I gotta finish it. This vlog <laughs> has been um a full circle moment it has been chaos a ride a journey but I loved every minute of it I cannot believe we were like hmm maybe Taylor will go maybe she won't mm, she's there mm, she's wearing a beautiful dress oh she won great oh she won another one that's awesome did she leave no she didn't leave she won video of the year oh wait she's releasing a new album on october 21st now we're meeting her at midnight it was a whirlwind and then she went to the after party and you guys i'm thinking that her style is going to be like old hollywood fashion and let me just say that is an era of fashion that i am obsessed with Taylor Swift, you have me in shambles. You looked so good. This this era is just gonna... Every Taylor Swift era is special, unique, but this one's just... Oh, I'm, I'm just... It's gonna be so good. It's just gonna be so freaking good. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, welcome to the Midnight's Era. We won't be missing anything on this channel. Trust me on that. I, uh, I can't believe this. We're getting TS10. I hope this video entertained you in some way. And I sincerely hope I see you. Yes, you. In the next one. Bye, guys.